Okay, hey, so um, I'm in this situation here. Uh, I put myself into it. I'm, a, I'm the attacker. Um, I'm playing as the Fey Enchantress. And um, I've got some support here from my pops to Leonese. It was pretty cool. I've got Henry here. And uh, I've got my own heroes. Um, Zachary, uh, his, all of his vows are complete. He's high level fairly. I think he's like 36 or something. Um, my life wizard here, a bit redundant, but she had a good trait, so I've kept her for a very long time. Um, I believe... I don't remember. Probably also a life wizard, I think. I don't remember. Been too long. Anyway, um, you can see I'm going up against nearly full force, full, four full stacks of... Um, Clan Moors, I have uh, Deathmaster Snitch down here. He's uh, <laughs> not going to be fun to be attacked by. Um, anyway, you can see that this isn't an ideal situation. Um, not controlling large armies is the ideal situation, uh, the, deal, the ideal um, strategy here. And something I recently learned myself, because I, I don't like to play with large armies, it gets really messy having to have 40 troops on the field at once. Uh, in a different battle, I discovered this strategy, and I've never seen anybody talk about it. And that is to uh, turn over your second army over to AI control. Now in this situation, it's a very bad idea. And that's because I'm sieging um, the standard um, Skaven city with um, the standard Skaven walls you'll see here in just a moment. And I'm doing it with knights, and knights are not intended to attack settlements like this, to siege walled cities. Um, yeah, I'm just going to get most of them wiped out. It's, it's not a good idea. So I wouldn't suggest it at all in this situation. What's better would be uh, an all-peasant army for the second army. Have repents. Uh, this is fine for, for sieging a city. Um, again, <laughs> knights aren't ideal, but when they're under your control, they're, they're pretty good. Uh, even against walled cities, as long as you have the Blessed Field Chebuchets here, like I do, in order to tear them down. Um, yeah, uh, she's a life wizard. I forgot. Um, so the situation is, this is not what you want to do. It would be better if my second army were a bunch of peasants. Um, that might sound odd to you all, but you'll see what I'm going to be doing here in just a moment. And this is pure nuts. Everybody squeezed in over here. Put these a little bit more central. Move my heroes. And start the battle. And uh, as you know, because we've restricted the enemy to one army at a time, they only have one army on the field. And now I have two. Um, granted, my second army is controlled by the AI, and they're going to just slaughter this army. So, again, this is not an ideal strategy in this situation. Um, it's actually a pretty evil, stupid one. Um, we're probably going to get some uh, clan rats here in a sec. Um, you know how that works. But... Um, some menace belows, and they're sending this uh, this guy off to die. That's a really good strategy there. But again, you know, if the situation were better, if I had, um, hey, thanks for putting clan rats there. Uh, don't uh, don't know if they're gonna make those guys explode or not. Oh, this isn't clan scryer, so they don't have nukes. That's good. Um, yeah, this is uh, Zachary. Yeah, Zachary Sigbald. Yeah, hi there, Zach. Uh, go, uh, go kill yourself, I guess. Good luck. I just want to tear down that. 
taking an awful lot of damage by these. I I'm only down to one. That's not ideal. Come on, Fey Enchantress, get in there. Look at this. I mean, this is unfair. They had four armies, and um, I had two, and I have reduced them down to one. Because, screw you, I cheat. This wasn't my ideal setup for an army. Um, I lost a lot of troops over the last many turns I've been on campaign. I had a lot more um, Grail Knights. I've had to replace them over time with other troops. Things that were quick to um, recruit. Um, like these peasant bowmen I don't think have any, any chevrons at all. They're just weak. Aha, huh, I have murdered that tower. I don't think I need to kill the other one. This one, yes. I don't think I need to kill that one. Those guys are going to get driven off in a moment anyway. I haven't seen any mess belows except the one. I expect a lot more. Let's uh, go ahead and tear that uh, gate down. I'm going to win this, of course, not by fighting all their armies, but by capping their town square. They'll, they can't defend it. You done, Zachary? I don't mind. He's immortal. He's got all of his vows sorted. So it doesn't bother me if I lose a couple of heroes per turn. What really sucks about this is I'm going to lose most of these knights. They're Grail knights. Uh, the Fae Enchantress, of course, is better with Grail Guardians. And um, I didn't have the ability when I left Carcassonne to uh, hire Grail Guardians. So I took what I could get and ran off to campaign. And um, might not be the best idea, but I couldn't sit around all day. Letting my enemies get stronger is not ideal. So uh, after this battle, um, if I lose all of these Grail Knights, I'll just uh, send a Fey Enchantress back home to um, recruit some Grail Guardians for her. I know Grail Knights, and of course, more importantly, um, uh, Hippogriff Knights are much better. Um, but I like I like playing to have fun. I'm I'm not just here to min max my troops. Here to have fun. Something in your way? Oh yay! Thank you for getting in my way. And they're not attacking anymore because um, that has been abandoned. Oh man, watching all those knights die for no reason. That's just awful. That's just criminal. Negligence. And she's undoubtedly going to send them in straight away. And he's getting reinforcements. It won't matter. Once I have the town square, you're dead. Oh my gosh, why do you have your knights here? Enchantress. 
fortress. Did they open the doors? They opened the doors. That is such a crappy tactic. What is this? Oh, use that. Use that on those guys, right there. <laughs> Come on. Rattling guns. These guys are just wasting their shots. I should name these guys Mr. Gorbachev. Mr. Gorbachev, tear down those walls. Cap that town square. Oh, these mechs are just dying. Well, I don't think I need to tear down the wall anymore. But these guys have been so weakened, I don't see any other use for them. This guy's a heal. See if I can save some of them. Where is her pants anyway? She's probably chasing some guy I told her to kill. Doing her job. Alright, let's get in there and cap that town square. Where are you guys? Being useless. <laughs> oh, oh, that's the mounted yeoman. Goodbye, mounted yeoman. You sucked anyway. Let's get that guy. Come on, we need that town square. These guys need to die because they uh, shot at me.
That's what you get for shooting at me. Die, chieftain. Oh. There's a guy here. An assassin, eh? Kill that guy. <laughs> hey, assassin, how are ya? Oh, they're out of arrows. No, one seventy three. You're in deep trouble, my friend. Zachary? No, that's the remnants of Grail Knights. Well, that unit's wiped out. Oh, you are so much in trouble. 78 seconds. There's no way you're winning now. I don't think they'll get over that wall, but, you know, why not? Oh, some shots are getting in. What is that? Thirty-three seconds. That's it. Now again, this uh, in this particular instance, this strategy is utterly stupid. Um, if it was a field battle, uh, I can see using this would be extremely good when you go up against more forces than you can handle. Um, in this case of uh, a uh, siege battle with 
Grail Knights is not going to go well if the computer is under control of one of the armies. Um, still, if you've got little other little hope otherwise, uh, yeah, totally do this. I mean, it works. <laughs> it's mean. It's ultra cheesy. Oh, look at those Grail Knights died. Um, but it works. And there you go, Fae Enchantress lost everything. Her Grail Guardians from the very, very beginning of the game are still alive. And that's, uh, that's just massively cool. I got, uh, Deathmaster Snitch's, uh, trait. There's Queek Head Taker right there. I can move the Fae Enchantress away. Get her out and get her home. Keep the rats at bay. That's my city now, punk. Don't need that. I feel like he's waiting for me to die, and then he's gonna take over. I probably should have built walls here, but eh. Too lazy now. Don't actually need anything else. I've got Trick and Felix right there, though. I should probably pick them up. Build that secondary peasant army I was talking about. Uh, ooh, Virtue of Duty, that's good. That's his vows. Pick up Gotrick and Felix. I can hire a peasant army. Akendorf is uh, pretty well set. Um, I just don't think I'm going to build that in time. Who cares about foot squires anyway? They don't have shields. Kind of useless. Anyway, give him a Pegasus. That's somebody else. Anyway, there you go. Strategy I've never seen anybody talk about or discuss. Turning over one of the armies to computer control so that you can have two armies on the field at once when the enemy only gets one. Anyway, you guys have a great day. Take care. My